Hey guys, it's same cool one for it here. I haven't done a video in ten days now, I think. Uh, but I've got quite a few DVDs to show you today. Um, most of them aren't DVDs which I got today or any other day, for the matter of fact. But um, most of them were uh, all. Most of them are all the DVDs which were done at my dad's. So there won't be any more excuses saying that they're at my dad's because they're here now, and that's all my DVDs from there in this house. So let's get cracking. This is a DVD which I got today and it's The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. I haven't seen this movie yet but it's done by my favourite director David Fincher. So I will enjoy it. It's the disc inside. I've heard really good recommendations from this movie and good expectations. So I'm really looking forward to watching this DVD so I will definitely be watching it tonight. And I'm looking forward to it. The next DVD which I got is Sandra Bullock and Ryan Menon starring in The Proposal which I got for £5 like you can see there. Um, this looks really good and it comes in like a really nice slip cover. I haven't seen this movie yet, I regret for seeing it in the cinema. Um, this looks so good. Ryan Reynolds one of my favourite actors. Uh, I think he'll be fantastic in this movie. And I hope Sandra Bullock's just this equally as good. So, yeah, I'll definitely be looking forward to seeing this. Next DVD which I got today was District 13 Ultimatum. This stars... Cyril Raffaele and David Bell, and I don't know if the camera can pick this up, but it's in this kind of like 3D uh, squeeze thing. Just the disc in there. I haven't watched this movie yet, but I will definitely check it out one of the days. I don't know when, and if I can get time to watch DVDs. Okay, moving on to the DVDs, which uh, were all done at my dad's. And the first one is The Long Way Down, which my dad gave me for my birthday last year. This is a really good TV sitcom. Um, first came out in 2007 I think, or 2006. Um, basically it's Ewan McGregor and Charlie Borman that go on a, a trip in Africa and Europe and everything like that. It is really good and it comes in a 2 disc special edition. It just got um, series 1, 2 and 3, and 4, 5 and 6. Which I really do enjoy this because my dad's, um, my dad himself is a motorcyclist and of course he's inspired by these guys because they obviously ride the bike. So yeah, it's really good. Check it out if you're a big fan of bikes like I am. And the next one is, again, the second one. It's the long way around the complete series, which is in disc one. You've got episodes one, two, and three, extra features. And disc two, you've got four, five, and six. Like you can see there. I don't know if you can, but yeah, just the exact same open this. But sure, I, I really do like this one, but I prefer the first one. So yeah. Next one is a fantastic movie and it's Billy Connolly live in New York. This is such a fantastic stand up comedy. Um, if you've ever heard of Billy Connolly, and I'm sure a lot of people have, he's one of the most, really, he's the best comedian in my opinion. He's just so funny, and of course, he's Scottish like I am, so we've got a lot in common. And of course, we've got the disc in there, so it's really good. I loved it. If you're a fan of stand up comedy, this is definitely recommended for you. So, yeah, check it out. Next DVD is Dumb and Dumb, starring uh, Jim Carrey and Jeff Daniels, which I found like a really funny DVD and movie. I'd probably class as my top five uh, comedy movies of all time, so that's a really good sign of this movie. So, um, so yeah, it's really good. It's only a single disc, but what the hell, I love this movie. It's fantastic. Probably Jim Carrey is best, I would say. This is a DVD which actually belongs to my mum, but she gave it to me because she's watched it, and it's the Eagles documentary which has got all the videos in it, and of course the just like a uh, kind of song tribute kind of thing, if you know what I mean. But yeah, no, I have watched this. It's quite good. It's not the best, but I like it. It's good. So yeah. Okay, if you remember, if you can reflect back or rescan your memories, I did have a DVD box set. And I did say I had three done at my dad's in which I've got them all here today. So let me show you them and it's the Lord of the Ring franchise. It's not just the trilogy. It's the full disc special extended DVD edition which comes like this. This is the Fellowship of the Ring. Really nice cover art. It's really thick. I thought it was a VHS at first. Yeah, it's really thick. Now let me show you inside. You've got nice cover art there. And there. And this is a really long kind of thing. It's like I'm going to get it up and show you. This is what it looks like. All four discs. You have to switch it over like at half, um, after halfway of the movie because it's like in a two disc kind of thing. And then it, the rest two discs are kind of 
um, just like special features. This is rated a PG, so yeah, it's really good. Next one is the Lord of the Rings, the two tables. Um, this one is probably my favourite out of the franchise. I just really enjoyed this much more than the first one and the third one. Um, yeah, let me show you inside. It. This one isn't as sturdy as the the previous case there. It's kind of more bendy, so yeah, I don't have any disadvantages in that. I will be keeping them safe anyway because my dad got with them and they were really dear. They were like, for all of them, it's like £110, I think. So yeah, I have to keep a really good eye on it. And of course, it's just the exact same inside. Let me show you. Yeah, just the disc there. So yeah, um, I have watched them. Oops, real leaf that fell out there. I have watched these DVDs. Um, like I said, this one is definitely my favourite in the franchise. Probably a lot of people's favourite. Um, but I, I just really did enjoy this. I thought it was great. It's a great sequel. It's fantastic. P uh, Peter Jackson is a fantastic director. His movies are really good and really enjoy every single one that he does. And of course the last in the franchise unfortunately to say, and it is, this is a region 1 exclusive of The Lord of the Rings Return of the King. As you can see there's no rating here, it just says PG-13, which I got from a region 1 import, which is really good. Like, the American versions are really good. And you've just got the cover up there, the front. And of course just the exact same inside like as the previous DVDs. Um, so yeah, let me show you that again once more. Yep, so that's basically all you get inside. But again you have to switch all you have to switch through after um uh, the half is finished so yeah, I don't have any disadvantages with that. I just think it's like a really nice idea that you get a full disc special edition to it. And of course this is the region one exclusive, so I really did enjoy it much more than the British version and it's funny to say because this has got much more scenes in it and I don't know why, it's just I just really like this box set, so yeah. So guys, that was my DVD update for today, the 27th of February 2010. I will be back with a video tomorrow. Um, hopefully I'll be getting around to do an overview of every single one of these um, box sets, the Lord of the Rings box set. So I'll see you guys later and I hope you enjoyed this DVD update. Uh, please subscribe, comment and rate. And when I hit 50 subscribers I'll be doing a Q&A and a shout out. So join me for that and I'll see you guys later. Bye.